The Chiefs obviously want to score a touchdown on every drive, but when they come up short, the team has one of the best kickers in the game. And this week, the Chiefs locked up Harrison Butker to a long-term contract, and it comes only weeks after we went viral for a Benedictine College commencement address. Fox 4 Sports' Harold Koontz is at training camp, where Butker addressed that too. He's now officially the highest paid kicker in the league for now. It's good to know that the kicker market is still uh, moving forward. I think offense is definitely the strength of the NFL right now. There's a lot of points being scored and kickers are part of that. Harrison Bucker says he's an introvert, so he didn't want all the attention with the big contract, but he did garner a lot of attention during the offseason, making a graduation speech at Benedictine College that made the rounds across the world. He commented for the first time today to local media about his thoughts on his graduation speech and the backlash or how it was received afterward. Prayed about it and I thought about it and I was very intentional with, with what I said and I stand behind um, what I said. And I really believe if people knew me as a person and, and understood that I was coming from a place of love and not a place of trying to attack or put people down, that I only want the best for people and uh, that's what I was trying to say. It led to some serious conversations with his family, including his wife. I think then it gets construed that I'm trying to put women down, which I'm not at all. I, I love women, I love my wife, and it comes from a place of love. You know, my wife had never heard me speak publicly, and she was there for that moment, and she was up in the background in one of the offices up there, and I was getting emotional. And his teammates. Been tons of conversations in the locker room with guys just connecting and trying to understand each other, and I think it's been, it's been a beautiful thing to see, and I think that's what's so special about sports and it's so special about football. I mean, there's not many sports where you have 50 to 100 guys with a bunch of different beliefs and we're all fighting together to win. We'll hear from QB1 later tonight. Harold Kutz, Fox 4 Sports.